Well, here we go again. Here we go again. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh boy, you're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Okay, let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One, two, three! Ugh. Mm. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. I can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy, loose springs. This is a tiny cabin. Why would this place be in the news? Was little Izzy's. I want to play a game. <laughs> Let's get you back to Izzy. That's going to come in handy later as a distraction, I think. Also, I, I doubt that little tiny rabbit would fit in that tiny bag. What are you supposed to put in that thing? It's tiny. It's like a bottle of soap or something. Maybe a toothbrush. I don't. Uh, I can't explore these other things or are they? Yeah, they're just locked. I wish there was a way to get rid of this, uh, letter boxing. Oh, wait, what did that? It just got, letter boxing just got. What's that? Ooh, swing has physics. Help. Okay, the swing does not have proper. 
proper physics. Ah, uh, sure. Ah! Just hit my water bottle. Everyone likes a scavenger hunt. And at Hackett's Quarry, that's no different. There are secrets in these woods. Fun secrets that, should you uncover them, could help protect you from criminal prosecution. After all, the stories you'll take with you are only stories without the proof to back them up. So it's time to dive into the mystery. Take Our character's gonna get pieces of arrested. And you may just prove your innocence. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Or not. Okay, yeah, no, this is innocence with other characters. Got it. Ouch. Let's hope Jacob hasn't seen this. So let's show Jacob. This is drugs. It's drugs, isn't it? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, no, you better. Is it Dylan's? Either way, you better take it. It prove useful. I have no clue where I do I need to go. The cab oh that's why I am supposed to look in the cabins. I don't know, I'm just looking around. There's. Ooh. So I go right. Don't want to be sweating right now. I'm just not coded. I don't know. I'm gonna see that. The only thing gonna allow me to enter any of the cabins. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. So I have no clue where to go. I mean, does it still say sir? Yeah, take a final look around the cabins. Okay. 
Can't be anything else really in there. Oh, what's this over here? Oh. There's a go-kart and a bridge. Ready to roll? Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. I don't agree, I don't agree with that. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. Nah. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. <gasps> oh, oh, wow! Oh. <gasps> nice steering, Tech. Jinkies. Okay, uh, so hypothetically, if reference. I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. It's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. When do you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss oh, you. Yeah, what's wrong with the email, Emma? What's wrong with it? Oh, hold up! Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Nah, I think I'm going to assist. We should really get back. Boo. Thumbs down. Everyone's waiting for us. Nick isn't gonna leave without saying goodbye. Shit, Abby! Oh. Too close. Sorry, squirrel dude. My girl here is on her way to ask a guy out for the first time, like, ever. Emma! <laughs> Couldn't let her squirrel out of it. I am going to throw you out of the cart. I deserve that. Daylight. Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so... Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No! <laughs> it's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, ew. <sighs> you know what? You know what he means? I to say you. Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, um, please. That sounds like a European Let's accent. go. Just gotta get these bags up onto the... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me, um, let me get it for you. I can take uh, care of my own bag. Yeah, Jacob. Are you, you sure? Can, Cause, I mean, it's really not that big of a deal. She can take care of her, her own, own bag. Bags. Thank you. Jacob. We can both. Take care of our own bag. Thank you. Okay, that's okay. Never mind. Yeah, he was just trying to be nice, cool. lady. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Thank you.
Not gonna lie, Abigail looks a lot younger than everybody else hey, there. Seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast. I was listening to a podcast, not a oh. band. Podcast, nice. That's oh. Cool. What's it about? Like, well, first I think he gives him the thumbs up. Now he's just... Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast yeah, called How to Look and phones. Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking dumbass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's uh, Quarry. Oh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, they're supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever, and then this figure that uh, floats that around. Oh, that thing like Silas or Silas? Some people or say. Whatever. <laughs> that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. Or kill you, or something. I don't know, it's never really been clear. Anyways. Haga Haggett's Quarry. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Right, his phone has power. Or, yeah, so. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time he told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for life. <laughs> Yeah, for you gotta life. Gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Do bullshit. Yeah. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Hop to it. Get those butts in gear. Sorry, Mr. H. Yeah, deliberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! Hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. And you could just put it on speaker. <laughs> I guess he wants to listen to it alone. <laughs> Maybe let's so, that uh, podcast. Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh oh, I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just you know about the whole thing w with the. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah, a little oh, privacy, sorry. man. <laughs> Hello. These drop. What? Hey, the kids. Don't need to show them up to the... They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have. Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's a okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know what? I know what. No, should I have? He's gone. 
Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. Sorry, I, I wasn't. I wasn't listening. I, he was, I was listening. Like waiting. Like, I mean, I heard. I, I mean, I was. I didn't hear what you were. Saying. We're cool, champ. Just come on. It's sorry I pushed you out like that. You, uh, you need a hand. Looking for the keys. Uh, no, end of summer. Busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, it's a, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know. My mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah. Alright, Ryan wants that fight. My, fam my family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. Dang it. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. But, do you know how many calls I get from parents? Letter after letter these terrified kids that they send home. Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Sorry. I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Gotta understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. It's a big part of being a counselor leader yeah just stick to kumbaya next time okay what's that you guys don't do kumbaya anymore good grief i'm outgrowing my own cliches <laughs> seriously chris what's going on i just want to get you guys safely out of dodge before the sun goes down Totally, yeah. Best to get you all out of harm's way. Woods are chock full of live game and local hunters hop to it the second camp's over. It's not safe. Hmm. Where in the good goddamn are they? And, uh, Jacob cut the fuel line. Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? Please. Sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrap yard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? I actually could have used the help packing up since we were short staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left uh -huh. him. Let's skedaddle. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. 
Good. Because it's time to dwell in the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. What's the problem? Ugh. Dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, dude, it's just like kaput. All right, let me try. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing Go, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Shit. Come on. All right, come dude, on. Chill. Chill, Let's go. dude. I'm God. Holy shit. Everybody back. Now, now, now. Jacob, wait, 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 wait. I got this. No, 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 don't. Ow, jeez, dude, I was trying to help. Yeah, don't pour water on an oil fire. Don't pour water on an oil. Okay. okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. I should have taken the, uh, lever. Okay. Damn it. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. There's a quick time event for everything, isn't there? Hey, Ron. Come here for a sec. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Yeah. Sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. So, what was that about? He uh said to stay inside. That we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Go inside? Well, we should go inside, like he said. Yeah. We could so... go inside until morning. Yeah. Or. Or we could do something else. No, we are. No, no. No, 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 no. We should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P-A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. No. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man. Caitlin? I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out. You know, like, um... Abigail and uh, Brian are the Why smart ones. Why would you want to scare us? I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. 
Yeah, dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. No, 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 dude, dude, it's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you, uh, you don't want to disappoint Daddy. Yeah, well, someone's got to give a shit. Oh. You know what? <gasps> I don't even care what you guys do. Oh. I'm doing what Chris told me to do. Ryan, come on, man. Wait. All right, all right, all right. Hacketeers. Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you go get some firewood. Uh, Emma and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just, I don't know, figure out how to charge the phones for something. All right, let's do this. Yeah, like I would have personally just sided with wrong. That's a sniper scope, I think. That guy looks like. God, I forget his name. How, how can I forget his name? That dude from, uh. From, uh. Blah, blah, blah. I forget the name of the. Uh, Detroit Become Human. I, why do I forget? How am I forgetting his name? Yeah, well, now I just like looking this up. I was hoping you'd come back to me. Let's see what you've found. Carl, that's his name. Carl. Temperance. That old guy looks like Carl. To be balanced. To consume in moderation. Or to indulge in excess. Temperance. Take it or leave it. But remember, sometimes... With temperance comes deferred gratification. There's more I can show you. Wouldn't be surprised if it's the same if name like. actor, dude. That's just more. I was hoping you'd say that. Ooh, crystal ball. Shotgun shells. You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Not for those with a story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. Okay, so the, uh, her, her cards seem to be like the, uh, totems from, uh, Until Dawn. Okay, well, I dare say that this seems like a uh, good place to stop it for this so little here we are, session. In the Great American Let's just check out what new stuff I got. Okay. Pass. Clues and empty vial ammo camp store. And uh, still got one tarot card. Yeah, that, that, yeah. Alright. That is all.